All right, so in a new survey, 45% of public schools nationwide felt understaffed going into the new school year. Nearly half, and that number is actually a little bit of an improvement right now. Hiring elementary and special education teachers, still a really big challenge. Liza Lucas has more for us on this. Liza, you've learned that retired teachers in Georgia are going back to the classroom to help in key areas. Good morning, Cheryl and Aisha. Yes, it wasn't clear how many teachers would take advantage of HB 385 when it passed last year. That bill, you may remember, letting certain retired teachers return to teaching with full pension and salary. But one teacher was open to sharing her perspective with me, so I went to Henry County to learn more. All eyes up here on the board. The lights are kept low in this Luella High classroom, a space where teacher Heather Hauser says learning is a two-way street. They are so unique. I learn from them every day. From social studies to special education, Hauser's passion for teaching kept her in the classroom for 30 years. Now she's back from retirement, helping fill a need amid a national teacher shortage. I just thought I have more to give back. Watching teachers return to the profession, a gift, says Principal Brandy Hardnett. When you see them in action, you see their gifts come to life. I mean, it is truly like watching magic in real time. Make you see light bulbs go off for kids, you see confidence stop. rise, and especially in these high critical need Leela. areas. That's for Hauser, it's the moving. joy of watching that students grow through moving. the years. This is Miss Harnett, my <laughs> principal, but I knew her when she was Brandy Davis. And now that she's back in the classroom. There's not the stress of teaching the second time around. I would almost do this for free. Just kidding, <laughs> but it's that much fun the second time around. Kidding aside, she's looking to the future, not to retire but to four more years to see her freshmen through. I want to be with them through their high school career so I can watch them walk across the stage and hug their necks and remember where they were. Now, I love this. Miss Hauser actually compares the experience of going back to teaching to being a grandparent. Not so much stress as raising your own kids, right? So she says she doesn't feel those same anxieties in the classroom that she once did. And she's just happy to be there for the joy of teaching. Now, Georgia Department of Education tells me nearly 340 retirees returned to teaching for this fiscal year. That's up from the 200 teachers taking advantage of the bill we told you about last spring.